about to enter the creep zone. The scary place. Gay, 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 no goo. Yes, this is Gay Gay no Kitaro, which is a long running Japanese manga. Gay, 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 no gay, asa. I'm guessing that's options. Usually the fourth one is. No, it's not options. Or it is options. Oh, did... Yes. Please tell me all about the little boy's penis. So let's see what this Giege no Kitaro is all about. Oh, hello. <laughs> you look a bit disturbed. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not saying much. I'm just completely immersed in this. The sound, the sprite work, the backdrops. It's just so absorbing. Oh, for fuck's sake. The problem is the charging takes too long. Well, he just seems to be sitting there and taking it now. Just fine by me. Oh, dear. That took absolutely forever to do. Alright, so this is a male system. I read male and it adds options to the map. Aha. I see. Oh, it finally resembles a platformer. It's a little bit like Ghouls and Ghosts in that your character's very weighty and you have to commit to everything. I don't like how easy it is to take a beating. Ah, oh, landed right on top of that enemy as well. Talking in the background is creepy. <laughs> it's an Oni with some thunder drums.
Where's it gone? This platforming's quite old school. By which I mean it's clunky and very uh, old fashioned. Oh no, don't fall all the way down. Get back up. irritating oh no land on something through the woods again. Oh, fuck that. Oh, wow. Okay, let's kill it. Jump into the foreground where I can get you. Why can't I hurt it? Can't jump on it? Oh, I see. I have a knockback attack that I didn't know I had. And that's how to do it. Okay. I see. Not every enemy can be defeated with bullets. If I knew about the knockback attack, it would have made that tutorial stage easier. I'm not sure it would help with uh, with the drum guy, but I think just... Uh, Practice would get me past the drum guy. Yeah, no, I got this, I got this, I got this. This is kind of neat, actually. Almost died, though. <laughs> but I did it. I beat a stage. Ah, this is save. Save in slot one. Saving now. Save complete. I'm gonna have another shot at um the forest and then this uh lightning guy. This Oni. Enemies just fall out of the sky on top of you. The second you stop moving. Feeling a bit more confident about the platforming as well. Oh, shit. Getting put off now. It's fine. It's fine. I got complacent. That's what... It's what it is. I'm getting complacent. It's fine. I got this. Got him. That was tough. That was like six attempts. Chase after the creepy girl, I guess. Oh, there's more than one. Oh, what? Oh, get serious. Well, if I can say a positive about this, this game is from back when Konami cared about making video games. So it's got that going for it. 
Now just you wait, with this health bar I'll get to the top and be expected to kill a boss with like one yellow flame left. Nope, because I didn't even make it to the top. Get that I can't just go straight there. I have to beat the level again. Okay, I've got some choice words to say about this Gega Geno Kitara game. It doesn't seem all that bad, to be honest. It's very archaic, very old-fashioned, definitely in the same vein as Ghouls and Ghosts. But it's also very difficult, like Ghouls and Ghosts, and I think, I think I probably could get good at this game if I dedicated some time to it. But, but first impressions. Difficulty is unrelenting. Certainly an interesting title, though. Japan,